Definitely I just like I just like how they hustle. Right. Like young dog too, them Oh yeah, too. for sure. We so how'd you link with Dolph? I know you said y'all cool, but like shit, it, like Dolph, he kind of just reached out to him. So we would just like he would just like my like, pull up, man. Call they phone like yes, that hate. If he bust downs and cut your posey off for me. I be fucking this NBA nigga, bitches. You know I ain't never gonna say shit. Now on my top, so nigga, what you won't do? I'm with some niggas with no name. When you say something, they like who? Don't know who I want. You the one I want. What up, gang? I'm back with another video. You already read that title. You already know what's going on. Let's get into it. Make sure you hit that like button, subscribe, and turn on your post notification. Let's get it, man. Listen, since Dolph has passed, a lot of people have been taking shots at Money Bad Yo and feel like Money Bad Yo ain't keeping it real because he haven't shown his condolences to Young Dolph. So let's get into it. If you don't know, when Money Bad Yo was an up and coming artist before he signed to Yo Gotti, before he really had a big buzz, Money Bad Yo had a song that was surfing around the city called I Need a Plug. And he was like, he needed a big feature on it. He wanted a big feature. And the three people he thought in his mind to get on the album was Yo Gotti, Jeezy, or Dolph. And one day, Dolph reached out to him and said, he messing with the music. He want to lock in with him. They linked up. Dolls jumped on um, Money Back Yo single, which was I Need a Plug. And it took off through the roof. And Money Back Yo career elevated to another level. And he was cool with Dolph. Money Back Yo was always cool with Dolph until he signed with Yo Gotti. When he signed with Yo Gotti, he was forced to pick sides. He was forced to pick sides. And he didn't necessarily beef with Dolph. He didn't necessarily say anything bad to Dolph. He just stopped communicating with Dolph. He just stopped rocking with Dolph. You know what I'm saying? And it been like that since he been with CMG. Now, he's passed. People feel like he should have said R.I.P. He should have gave his condolences. Hey! This my opinion on it. Once he signed with Yo Gotti, and Yo Gotti was beefing with Dolph publicly, where it got serious, was where shots was fired, and someone got and Dolph got shot, and people got hurt, or whatever the case may be between a beef. Money bag Yo already picked his side by not speaking to Dolph no more. I don't think that you guys should look for young, I mean, Money Bag Yo to post a RIP post to Dolph. For the simple fact, Money Bag already picked this side when he signed with Gotti and he distanced himself from Dolph. So, y'all can't really look at Money Bag Yo like he wrong. Because if that's the case, y'all should have been saying he was wrong from the start when he distanced himself and stopped talking to Dolph when he signed with CMG. He basically made Dolph his enemy when Yo Gotti made Dolph his enemy. You feel what I'm saying? So that's just how it is. But as you know, Gotti went through it with Dolph. Black Youngster went through it with Dolph. But Money Back Yo never publicly went through it or had no beef or said nothing ill towards Dolph publicly. So while this situation was going on, he was just in the cut, but he did distance himself from Dolph. And I feel like as a man, it come a point in the time where you can't let anybody else dictate your friends, but 
to be real, once somebody get hurt, you can no longer be on both sides. You feel what I'm saying? Like, for instance, money bad, yo sign with Gotti, right? Allegedly, one of Gotti people shot Young Dolph. Moneybag Yo It's gonna be awkward for Moneybag Yo and Young Dolph to be hanging around. First of all, Young Dolph not gonna even trust the situation because he gonna be wondering is Moneybag Yo gonna give up his location? Is Moneybag Yo gonna back down? This the stuff that's gonna be going in his mind if he would have stayed cool with Dolph and really still been friends with Dolph at the same time being signed and you got it and at the same time got it people trying to kill Dolph. First of all, Dolph wouldn't even allow money back you around him because you can't take that chance of having money back yo back door Dolph. You feel me? Even if Money Bad Yo would would never do that, Dolph don't know will he ever do it. You know what I'm saying? That's just like you cool with somebody, and just say like you cool with a dude, and his best friend shoot you, and he always with his best friend. So when he's around you, and you know what's up, when he's around you. It's going to be like looking over your shoulder. And then another thing, his, by his best friend having access to him, it's easily for his best friend to get you again because it's like, bro, well, yeah, even if he tell him, if even if he don't tell him he with you, well, yeah, oh, but I'm over here on the east end. He know what area you's in, you in. He know nine times out of ten you might he might be chilling with Dolph. He know money back yo if he would have stayed cool with Dolph money back yo can't post him hanging out with Dolph because he'll know exactly where he at. So it was no way they could have kept a friendship. You feel what I'm saying? It's no way. And if people would have if people even think that was possible, then you're not from the streets and. And that's a good thing. But you're not from the streets and you're not thinking straight. There's no way I'm going to still hang around a dude that one of his partners or people affiliated with him did any harm to me or trying to do some harm to me. Even if he has nothing to do with it and even if I know deep in my heart that he's not going to do no wrong to me or, or won't nothing happen to me, I got to distance myself because he's still connected to them people. And them people connected to him. I could be easily chilling at his house and them people pop up. You feel what I'm saying? Me and him could be easily chilling somewhere and his homies see his car and stop and I'm with him. You feel what I'm saying? So for the people that's looking for the uh, money back, yo, to say something, I don't think that's fair. And I don't and, and I think that money back, yo, already picked sides long time ago. So we shouldn't be expecting money back, yo, to say R.I.P. Dog. Gang.